At a rally yesterday in Big Falls Village, opposition leader Francis Fonseca applauded the efforts of the Belize Territorial Volunteers while stating the actions of government left a lot to be desired. This is a shame and a disgrace on this UDP government. Let us be very clear, my friends. Let us be very clear. We have made it clear in the People's United Party. We have made it absolutely clear that we will say no to the ICJ. This incident today in Belizean waters proves to us why we must say no to the ICJ. It confirms for us why we must say no to the ICJ. Because the Guatemalan government is not acting in good faith. And our leaders, those who want to take us to the ICJ, the Barrow, Mr. Prime Minister Barrow and Foreign Minister Ellington, they don't know what they are doing. They are incompetent and they are failing beliefs and we will not allow them to lead us down the wrong road and into an ICJ where Belize stands to lose its territory. We want to live in peace with Guatemala. Guatemala is our neighbor. They are not going anywhere. Belize is not going anywhere. We must find a way to live in peace. But, but, that peace, that peace must be based on mutual respect. And it must be based, and it must be based and it must be based on Guatemala's recognition and understanding of the sovereign territory and territorial integrity of our country. The People's United Party sent out a release this evening, which it states, quote, The trip was a political statement that Belize, all of Belize, from Rio Hondo to Sarstoon, from our keys and atolls to our western border, is ours to protect and defend, and that this is not a task for only the military and diplomats." End of quote. 